Hi, welcome to Life, Death, and the Space Between podcast. I'm your host, Dr. Amy Robbins. Today, I'm going to be sharing a poem that was inspired by one of my podcast listeners. If you haven't had a chance yet, we shared one of her stories last Monday. She talked about her connection with an old boss of hers and the deep connection that they have had even since her boss has passed away. But today I'm going to share with you the poem that she wrote that was inspired by this podcast. In the Absence of Opposites by Susan Lipson In the absence of opposites, the light is unending. No one ponders the purpose of pain or hardship since they never endure such challenges there. In the absence of opposites, no shadows, literal or metaphorical, follow us around to heighten physical awareness since no physical bodies exist there. In the absence of opposites, No sadness makes us more grateful for moments of happiness because there we are happiness. We are gratitude. In the absence of opposites, no challenges are motivated by the mantra, no pain, no gain, because neither pain nor gain, nor loss for that matter, exists there. There, in the absence of dualities, of paradoxes, and of relativity, Life and peace and oneness and love are all simply being. There's something and nothing are one and the same. Superlatives do not exist. And the primitive social construct once known as absence has been replaced by presence. But here, where I am now, I experience my world through memorable juxtapositions, through contrasts and comparisons, through paradoxically poignant moments. And here, now, I realize that this attempt to express my thoughts in philosophically poetic lines might actually amuse me. Someday, if, after my body's expiration, I am summoned by a reader, echoing my words, someone who still marvels at these primitive imaginings about the absence of opposites. Thank you so much, Susan. And if anybody else has anything to share, could be anything related to life, death, the space between, thoughts on it, your experiences, please reach out to me. You can find me, but probably not quickly, on Twitter or Facebook but really on Instagram at Dr. Amy Robbins or at Gmail at Dr. I'm at Gmail at Dr. Amy Robbins at gmail.com. Seems like a mouthful. So thank you all. I hope you all had a wonderful Thanksgiving and stay tuned for more from Life, Death, and the Space Between. Like what you heard today and want to hear more? Curious about what comes next and what it all means? You can subscribe on iTunes. Just go to podcasts and find life, death, and the space between and hit subscribe. And you can follow me on Twitter and Instagram at Dr. Amy Robbins. Ask me any questions you might have. Let me know what else you'd love to hear about or just share your story. I can't wait to hear from you.